Hi, this is Tom DeMarco, uh, here to tell you about a new book of mine, uh, a novel. This is my third, uh, available in English now, but soon to be available in German, uh, coming to you from Hanser Verlag at the end of this year. Uh, the title in German is Als auf der Welt das Licht ausging. Uh, it's a story of a group of physicists, a uh, university uh, research laboratory of physicists that discovers a way to make a tiny disruption in the flow of time, to slow it very slightly. Uh, and they build a laboratory uh, in which they have induced this effect by uh, a very precisely controlled magnetic fluctuation uh, through the field uh, of the laboratory. And they uh, uh, go into the lab and they find that things are not so different in there. The, 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 the time is, is, is slower, but you know, your, your watch is slowed down, your body clock is slowed down, you don't even get an extra hour of sleep. Uh, so they conclude that there isn't much of an effect, but when they start to do some tests, they find something rather astonishing, that uh, materials that were formed in the time when in, in the normal flow of time, uh, in the new slower flow of time, no longer have sufficient energy to flash, to explode. Uh, so uh, you can't strike a match, you can't shoot a gun. Um, they realize they have a way to inhibit war. They could inject this precisely controlled fluctuation onto the Earth's magnetic field, and war would be impossible. You couldn't have guns, or bombs, grenades. Um, war would be impossible, but a lot of other things would also be impossible. Um, the lights would go off all over the world. Uh, not so good. Planes and trains and cars and trucks. Um, what would you do with such an invention? They, they decide to write up their findings, uh, put them in a locked file cabinet, and never mention them to anyone. Um, but then events overtake them. Uh, in particular, the world seems to be spiraling in 2014, as it did in 1914, 100 years ago, uh, into a ruinous war. Uh, and when indeed uh, the nuclear exchange seems to be inevitable, they turn on the effect worldwide and they stop the war and they stop everything else. They repeal uh, the last 150 years of scientific advance. They turn off the lights. Um, and now they have to invent a new society. And that's what this novel is about. It's about how would you reinvent society uh, under these new worlds, uh, new, new rules. Um, it's also an adventure story because those who would like to get the war going again are tracking them down and they have to hide uh, so that they're not caught and have their, their machine destroyed so that the war can start again. Uh, and it's also a love story. Uh, Lauren Martin, the, the young scientist who has made the critical breakthrough uh, is falling in love with uh, a lowly lab technician. Her name is Kelly, and, and she seems to be as intellectual, uh, he's in love with her, but she seems to be as intellectual inferior because she has no education. But in the new world, education is not the most important thing. The most important thing is talent, and she has a talent for leadership, and eventually emerges as the natural leader uh, of the new community. Uh, that's the beginning of their love story. How it ends, I won't tell you. Uh, you'll have to read the book to find out. Uh, Als auf der Welt das Lichthaus ging, coming to you uh, from Hanser Verlag at the end of this year.